kiddo. Today we're going to be reading Finding Kindness by Deborah Underwood, illustrated by Irene Chan. Kindness is sometimes a cup and a card, or a ladder, a truck, and a tree. A scritch and a cuddle, a rake and a yard. A cookie, a carrot, a key. Okay. She gave him a cookie for raking her yard. And this guy dropped his keys, so he's giving them back. It's seeds and a feeder, a seat on the train. A daisy, a peach, or a pie. A wave at a baker, a boost on a crane. A sandwich shared up in the sky. Ooh. Kindness is sometimes a tip in a case or a tap when a lace is untied. It's taking a photo or making some space. It's a racket, a rocket, a ride. It's dirt and a shovel, petunias and pails. It's trees that will someday give shade. It's plans and a hammer. It's lumber and nails. It's houses and cold lemonade. Kindness is sometimes just taking a break or sitting with someone who's sad. Forgiving yourself when you've made a mistake or forgiving a friend who got mad. Let's see, they were fighting a little bit because the little one spilled some lemonade. Hmm. It's cuddling puppies, it's holding a door, it's a toy and a treat and a comb. It's seeing the animals others ignore. It's a leash and a lick and a home. Kindness is sometimes a song or a stick or a high and a bat and a ball. It's soup when a neighbor is sneezy and sick or a scoop if one happens to fall. It's reading a story, it's feeding a fish, it's a bucket, a book, and a yard. It's kissing a sister, it's wishing a wish. It's a bug and a cup and a card. How nice. What does kindness mean to you? What are some ways that you would like to show how kind you are?